9.1, number 21. Um, find the values of x for which the geometric series converges and find the function of x it represents. So the function of x that it represents um, is just when you uh, apply the a, so the initial term over 1 minus r. So our initial here, when you plug in 0, uh, you're taking sine x to the 0, which is 1. So it's 1 over 1 minus the r is what you're taking to the nth power. So think of this as sine x to the n. So that's my r. So it's 1 over 1 minus sine x. That's what it'll be if you add them all up. It's just, That's a sum of a geometric infinite series. Um, and that's only true if the r is between negative 1 and 1, not including negative 1 and 1. So find the values of x to which the geometric series converges. So that's only if sine x is greater than negative 1 and less than 1. Okay, so sine x, a couple ways to represent it is we know that it's a periodic function looks like this. It'll hit 1, which it will not converge at that point. It also hit negative 1 and 1, and so we need, it will converge everywhere except when it's 1 or negative 1. On that unit circle, you can think of it as, where is sine x? Sine is the y value, so right here at pi over 2. So this would be pi over 2. And then right here at 3 pi over 2. That's when it's negative 1, so right here is 3 pi over 2, and so on. So it looks like it happens every pi where it's not going to converge. So what values work? I'd say all reals except for. The way I like to do it is if I know that I'm going up pi every time, I find the first one that it where it, we're looking for at pi over 2, so x can't be pi over 2, and then I know I'm going up pi every time, so pi over 2 plus n is an integer. So find the first one, and then figure out what you're going up by, and then um, multiply that by n. Okay, so it'll converge for all x except for those ones. Uh, you could also represent um, x not equal to um, pi over 2n, or n is an odd integer. So if n is 1, yeah, we're at pi over 2. If n is 3, then we're at 3 pi over 2. Um, if n is 5, we're right here to 5 pi over 2, and so on. So that's these are literally the same thing. However, you want to represent it. So it would converge for all those except all values except for those.